Hey, it is a bit of a homecoming for our next guest, who is a graduate of both UIC, yeah, go Flames! At Governor State University. Mm -hmm. But she came, she has gone on to bring laughter to audiences around the world. Yeah, comedian, actress, and TV personality Cheryl Underwood is joining us with details on shows here at the Chicago Improv. Welcome mm -hmm. back home. Yeah, you know what? It's always nice to come to Sweet Home Chicago. Yes. You, know, mm -hmm. you gotta come home. I went to Gresham Elementary School here oh, you as did? well. Oh, okay, yeah. wow. because I thought you grew up in Arkansas. Yeah, me too. Uh, well, I was born in Arkansas, but I was raised here. I was starting on the west side, then moved to the west south side. side. Girl, we got a lot west in town. Side. Ooh, there you but go. then I had to go to the South Side oh. and hang out. And my comedy career kind of grew here as well once I came back uh, from California. And I got my associates at Fresno City, came back here to go to UIC. Uh -huh. And my dad, you know, raised me here. I used to come every summer. And I always used to go to like Gus Savage. Uh, he mm -hmm. used to have the picnic and yes, everything. Yes, so yes. I'm, I'm Chicago. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm Chicago all the way, yeah. all the way. And right. dated a lot of bears. And oh, you did? Oh, oh, do tell. Oh, who? Did you have any in the Super Bowl team uh, winning thing? Let me just say, uh, I helped a couple of people, you know, get in the playoffs. So, uh, so, you know, you're like kind of the Taylor Swift of the Bears. Listen to me. That girl is doing it the way we all want to mm -hmm. do it. Have yep. a supportive man. Mm -hmm. And I, the, Okay, if you're watching the talk and you hear Jerry and Agbar talking about he need to propose at the Super Bowl, no, he doesn't. No, no woman wants that. No, mm -hmm. nobody wants that. That's Thank right. You. She does not want that. She wants uh, uh, violins and flowers and quiet. And yes. peace and, and get on, not as uh, yeah, extravagant. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. Mm -mm, but no. I think they're going to get married. I, I called it first. Okay. I think they're going to get married. I agree with you. Yeah, I, I think agree with you. She uh, needed a regular dude. Okay, mm. what y'all want to ask? What's uh -huh. going on? <laughs> well, so, I mean, Chicago is kind of the place to be if you're going to be a comedian. I mean, it must have been a great starting ground for you. Oh, absolutely. When you're talking about Bernie Mac and yeah. Adele Givens, you know, all of us as comics coming up together. And I remember when uh, we were doing the Miller Lite comedy search, and Damon Wayans was one of the judges and he was like, you're going to go far. And now we're all on TV or radio and really living our best lives. So it's cool. it's really great to be from here with all of this history. And then you got Second City, so mm -hmm. if you really want to learn improv, that's the place to do it. Yeah. Also, I want to give a shout out to you as my fellow Pan Hill. Okay. I mean, uh, you were at the Elite Eight, the mm -hmm. Divine Nine, you Zeta Phi Beta. Yes. You were national president. Yeah, that is no small feat. 23rd international president of Zeta Phi Beta. Matter of fact, I joined Zeta in Zeta Ta Zeta chapter here in Chicago yep. while I was working on my master's degree. You are a AKA. Oh, okay. A greetings, you, greetings. Yeah, from the A to the Z. There okay, you go. Okay, there you go. And for everybody wondering why I'm not wearing red right now, my first job was at the Chicago Heart Association out oh, of college on 36th okay. and Wacker yes. Drive. Mm -hmm. But I just flew in from Los Angeles. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So these are my flying clothes because I didn't want to be late. Yes. Oh, well, we, we appreciate it. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> we ever appreciate okay, it. what else you want to ask? I got to ask you, okay, because yes, you. Mm -hmm. The, the TV, the stand up yeah. comedy, the mm. shows, the movies, mm -hmm. you know, philanthropy, mm. everything that you do. Tiny and I are moms too. Like, how do you do it all? Well, first I put God first. Okay. And then I put everything in place and I let people do what I hired them to do. Okay. You Ooh, know, I don't okay. micromanage, I kind of manage. Okay. I don't like to micromanage. And then as a woman, sometimes you got to care about yourself. Yeah. You know, you got to care about your weight. You got to care about your mental health. And I got a great team of people working with me. Matter of fact, in this show, you know, Mike Washington's on the show. He's flying in right now from uh, Washington, D.C. area. Then you got Kyle Irby, who's with me. He does great comedy. He's from Los Angeles. And then we have something at the end of our show where we salute guys. So a man can get up on stage and do whatever he wants to do to get the crowd on his side. And he may win some money. Oh! Yeah. Okay. And we've oh. had guys salute their wives and girlfriends and get, some guys get up and they sing or they do something and great looking guys but that normally doesn't happen in a female show yeah. so when you ask me well how do I do everything I'm doing I put it in its proper order okay all right, and talk about being a female co comic because that is not easy mm -hmm. at all mm -hmm. it's right like, you're about talking about breaking a glass ceiling absolutely, absolutely and now you're headlining the show absolutely I think most people well, I'm hosting this show so I get to go in between everybody um, and it's a little more daytime friendly but it's still for the grown and sexy mm -hmm. we will be using a lot of salty language Okay. So you'll see another version of Daytime Cheryl. But what's great about this, you get to take that money. And I have a sports initiative for young boys that I'm working on with a lot of really great athletes. So if you just, all you got to do is time management and get some sleep, get some rest, <laughs> and, you know, keep your body together. I've lost yeah. 100. I know. Uh, yes, talk about that. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Are you I mean, sharing with people how you did that? Oh, we go, V. And I'm not one of those celebrities that go, I did it in the gym. Nope. I had to jump start it somewhere. Yeah. You know, really get my diet together, get yes. some sleep. 
sleep, drink water, you know, move around, eat some fruit and vegetables, internalize stress. I had to get that out of my oh, life, yeah. you know. But I was proud to say that I started on Saxenda, then went to Wegovy. I'm no longer pre-diabetic or diabetic and no high blood pressure. And I really want to work with the companies that make this because it needs to be accessed by all people yes. because they talk about weight management as if it's a willpower yes, thing no. and it's not necessarily a willpower situation. Yeah, I hear a lot, a lot we, of yeah, we've long talked about the, the shaming that when yeah. I was so stupid. Yeah. People the first problem people are having is that all these diseases stem from That's weight right. Gain. That's right. That's right. So yes. you need weight management and don't tell somebody, well it's your fault. No. Well, sometimes you don't know what's genetically in them. You don't mm -hmm. know what stress they're under. Mm -hmm. You don't know if they don't have access to mm -hmm. you know great food because you're in a food desert mm -hmm. or you're living under such stress that is causing you to gain weight. So right now, I, I really love the life that I'm living. How can you go from Def Comedy Jam and BET Comic View to daytime TV mm -hmm. to working on the road and then coming out to the Chicago Improv? I mean, I love coming home. I love my family and my friends that I have here. As a matter of fact, I was in the Air Force Reserve out at O'Hare Field. I oh, heard that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you're able to do that because you are healthy. That's right. Cheryl, thank, thank you for thank sharing you. that. Thank Thank you. All right. So much Are there still here. tickets for uh, Cheryl Absolutely. Underwood and Friends Comedy Tour? Come on, get some tickets. All right. Get some tickets. Got right four there. shows. Yes, four right. shows tonight and Saturday, uh, mm -hmm. seven and nine thirty on both nights. So check it out. Mm -hmm. Cheryl, thank you. 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 Thank you.